Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. Now, today's video, I'm going to focus on a specific series that I've just finished watching. So if you are a soccer coach or you're in the soccer industry, now I would highly recommend that you, once you're done watching this video, you go back and if you are a subscriber to, to Amazon Prime, I would really recommend watching their new series on Arsenal Football Club, which is called All or Nothing Arsenal. Now, the reason why I decided to make this video, because after I finished watching uh, this, this series, which isn't, I haven't watched it all yet, but it's only three, three episodes in, but there was something that really caught my attention. And the thing that really caught my attention was that within the series, there is one particular coach, which is a, a coach called Carlos Cuesta. And his main role is he's an individual development coach. Now, what he does is he works with the, the first team players on an individual basis. So part of his day to day role is he, he helps them with the, the mental side of the game, with the technical side, the tactical side. And he basically, he, he makes them better once all the, uh, the team training sessions are finished. So essentially what his role is, is on a day-to-day -day basis, he will work with two or three players after all the training sessions are done for the day. So once all the team training sessions are done, this specific individual development coach will work with some of the first team players on a one to one basis. Now, this specific role, having done a little bit of research on this, uh, on this, his specific role is is a role that has become uh, quite common over the last, I would say, two years, right? Now, what, what team and head coaches, first team coaches are starting to realize is that there's specific athletes or players within a team environment that need that individual attention, that, that, that individual or specific help. So that's why now you're going to start to see first team coaches in, in the professional game, whether that be in soccer, whether that be in basketball, whether that be in, in the NFL, American football, baseball, whichever sport it might be, you're going to start to see these individual development coaches who are going to come in and work with players on an individual basis, right? So they, they are part of the actual coaching team of the first team environment, but essentially what their role is, is they're, they're employed to help players on an individual basis because there's certain things that they, that head coaches can't work with them on when they're working with a team. Also at the pro level, head coaches are normally very, very busy. So they don't have the time to dedicate to working with players individually which means bringing in an individual development coach, which essentially is a, is a private trainer, is a solution to, to their problem. Now, what relevance does this have with your coaching business, right? So if you're a private trainer watching this, then you should be making note because this is going to be the future of first team uh, teams, right? And what's gonna start to happen is this is gonna to start to trickle down into the grassroots and youth sports. So where head coaches want to try and get an advantage over other teams, over other clubs, they're gonna to start to bring in these individual trainers that are gonna work with, it might be their goalkeeper, it might be their defenders, it might be their strikers, right? They're gonna hire out these individual trainers to come in and work with specific players on specific things. Okay, so if there's there's an athlete within that team that is really struggling and that coach doesn't have the time 
to work with them, then they're going to start to hire out trainers to come in and specifically work with that individual, right? So wanted to make this video because it's, it's a message for everyone out there that this industry is going to get bigger and bigger. It's going to get more professional, right? Now you're starting to see uh, uh, football associations, uh, like for example, FIFA, UEFA, and other organizations who are starting to now create webinars and courses on individual training, right? So this industry is gonna to start to continue to grow. It's gonna get bigger and bigger, and essentially it's going to become more professional, which means there's gonna be a lot of great opportunities for great trainers that are in maybe in the youth setups that want to go into a first team environment and just focus on the individual training, okay? Because if, if a huge club like Arsenal have realized, you know what? Our first team players, right, need this attention, need this personal help, then that is a message for other teams out there. That if this big club needs those individual trainers to come in and work with their athletes, then that could be the future and that could be a way of teams getting an, an advantage over other teams okay so thank you for watching this was a short video right but finished watching the episode and i had to share this on the channel so if you haven't already check out go to if you have an, an amazon prime account or if you're a subscriber to amazon prime okay all or nothing arsenal it's a new series that is recently uh, been released Go check it out. You'll get loads of tips behind the scenes of how a, a first team, a professional environment works. And also you'll see a little bit of, of clips of what the individual development coach does with athletes at that high level. Okay. Thank you for watching. See you in the next one.